Meet people just like you. Cynthia is a sophomore student. Just like you, she started school bright, shiny, and ready to take on the world. However, when she goes to lunch, she has no one to sit with because she was seen holding hands with another girl. Joseph's dad lost his job and money is tight. Even though his clothes are clean, they are from last year. People would comment and ask, where do you shop, Goodwill? Maria's skin color is different than her peers. She's proud of her Mexican heritage. Her peers constantly ask her to say words in Spanish. She doesn't speak Spanish. They tease her, telling her that she needs to go back to Mexico to become a real Mexican. Kyle was walking down the hall and someone shoved him, causing him to drop his books. Laughter erupted along with comments such as get a life. Donovan struggles in school. He has learning challenges that require him to receive academic assistance. His peers let him hang out with them, but ignore his ideas and disregard his contributions to their group. Jess likes attention. She loves Snapchat, Instagram, and other social media just like her peers. Some of the high school girls are annoyed at her and begin to send negative comments and pictures to her Snapchat. She lives with a foster family, but doesn't want others to know. Every time someone is judged, a mark is left, a scar. No matter how hard we try to smooth out the wrinkles, the person never will go back to the same person they were before, before the negative comments, behaviors, and attitudes. We can try to smooth wrinkles, fix the rips, and repair the damage, but that person will never be the same. They will forever carry scars of being treated without respect, a respect that all human beings deserve and should receive.